Yo, what is going on everyone? Guiding Light here back with a quick Dead Island 2 video and in this one I'm going to show you guys how to get one of the best weapons in the game. Now all you have to do is fast travel over to the pier and you will get started on a lost and found quest. Now once you have fast traveled to the pier, go right outside the front door and you may have noticed that there's this big enemy here in the front. Now I always just ran past him because I didn't really feel like taking him out. But if you end up killing him, he will drop a special quest called Fool's Gold. So this is going to be one of the lost and found quests. Simply pick it up and it'll give you some hints on how to finish it. Now the first step is to go to his locker and all you have to do is walk around the corner for this part. This quest only takes a few minutes to complete so I highly suggest getting it done early just to get one of the best weapons makes the ending of the game a lot easier. And since this doesn't even really require killing very many enemies, I do suggest doing it. So coming around the corner, you will go ahead and grab that next note. This will bring you on the next part of the quest. Now it's a bit of a walk, so I will see you guys once we get to the location. Now that you've made your way through the pier, you should be at this little clown house in the back. Now all you have to do from here is dodge most of these zombie enemies and you should see a, a bench over here in the corner. This is where you're going to find the phone. So simply grab the phone and now you're going to actually make your way almost all the way back to where we came from. So I'll show you guys the path you need to take. This will bring you guys to the next note. It's basically just a giant scavenger hunt. Now you can kill these zombies if you want to and you should probably get some decent drops from it. But if you've already completed most of the story and you're just after the weapon, you can go ahead and power through them. So here's the path you'll need to take. Now as you've made your way across the map, you're going to come into this back alley. This is where you're going to find the third note. Now from here, you will have to go on another little run over to the fourth note. But once you guys get to this part, it actually will be the end. So follow the path one final time over to where this last location is. From here, there will be a ton of zombies to kill. So at this point, if you need to get some medkits or things together, be sure to do that. There are going to be like 20 zombies, maybe 30 zombies at this next area. So come across the beach and you'll see this little back alley. Once you get here, the zombies will spawn. Simply take them out and you will get an insane drop. So I'll show you guys what the drop looks like. Other than that, though, that's pretty much it for this mission. Hopefully it helps you out and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace. Now for that, ahoo, ahee, it's all for me.